good morning children yesterday we completed uh, one topic no so what is this uh, on land animals and water animals so the four limbs only have no this all all our animals have four limbs they can use different different types of so the front limbs four limbs the hind limbs like that the topics already totally completed so today another topic migration uh, among animals okay migration among animals migration among animals second lesson last topic okay children migration among animals all animals migrate migration migration means what is the migration migration means uh, the mass movement in animals they can move one place to another place It is known as migration they can move one place to another place long distance certain long distance they can move uh, one place to another place so animals birds and fishes they can uh, travel a long distance one place to another place that is called a migration so they can fly uh, so many days so many months on the sky like that only they can travel so uh, migration uh, migration means uh, one um, but they can move one place to another place a uh, long distance okay so uh, especially uh, all birds uh, birds are, in the birds the migration is very common so here one bird like stalks stalks and the mallard ducks and the mallard ducks mallard ducks they can travel another countries to uh, they can come to in our country india in winter season uh, these stalks and mallard ducks they can travel another countries and uh, and uh, these birds come in our country india in winter season only uh, they these birds come in our country so they can travel so many months so many years like that only travel in the sky so uh, every year winter season these bir these birds and uh, uh, stalks and mallard ducks so these ducks and the stalks uh, they can return from the Uh, our country in winter season okay winter season every winter season every winter season every winter season okay next fishes okay fishes also uh, some fishes uh, lives in rivers so uh, sometimes uh, eels special fishes have like eels eels some fishes eels these uh, fishes uh, they can travel first uh, first they can live in water only uh, uh, they can live in rivers uh, after uh, they can travel the uh, migration they can start the migration they can travel uh, river into seas they can travel river to seas okay river to sea in the sea only they can lay the eggs in the sea only they can lay eggs ha after this hatch the uh, eggs hatch the eggs and the baby egg ones okay in the eggs hatch after the small babies come outside of the uh, egg the egg ones egg ones come after the parent egg the parent uh, that the parent fish will died the parent fish will died after these egg one travel uh, the parent will travel back where the parent had started their journey it will uh, travel back to that river only it will travel back to that river only so it happens in that eels fishes eels fishes Okay, children. Now, so what to understand? Eels fishes started their journey the river to sea. In the sea, only they can lay the eggs. After hatching, that uh, eggs, the babies uh, 
come outside the young ones afterwards the parent eels will die okay next these young ones travel back to their parents had started their journey their journey it will go back okay okay like that only migration having the fishes next locusts locusts okay locusts we know very well locusts uh, these locusts swarms standing on the crops these locusts standing on the crops okay uh, this destroy our crops uh, the long distance the locusts also migrate so long distance uh, they can uh, came from another countries these locusts came from another countries and these locusts uh, stand these locusts swarms stand on the crops it destroy our crops so uh, these are also harmful uh, migrate migrate migration in locusts harmful migration in locusts very harmful harmful okay these all are in harmful insects insects harmful insects so these locusts are harmful insects they can destroy our crops okay children uh, next uh, some butterflies also have some butterflies the butterflies also they can uh, start their migration so one special butterflies also have monarch butterfly monarch butterflies monarch butterflies monarch monarch butterflies they can start their journey to canada to uh, mexico canada to canada to mexico so they started their journey they travel their migration canada to mexico these special butterflies monarch butterflies some also, some butterflies also they can start their migration but here specially monarch butterflies they can travel canada to mexico okay next
the European stocks travels Europe to Africa every winter. So different different types of uh, birds and animals they can migrate, they can move the mass movement on these animals one place to another place. They can search food, they can uh, escape the harsh weather uh, purpose, they can escape the harsh weather purpose, they can search food and they can search for food purpose and they can breed in their uh, breeds. Uh, like that they can move uh, so many long distance they can move. These mo mass movement we will call the migration. So different different migrations are there. So uh, in, uh, they can uh, region also came in these 35,000 kilometers they can travel after they can uh, they can complete their migration after they will they will back to come to their home they can recognize their home how it's possible uh, we are uh, very uh, we are, when we are thinking means it's a miracle why because the way of uh, route uh, how they can recognize uh, in the sky the route uh, how they can recognize we don't know they can uh, uh, they can uh, use their uh, some they, some birds they can use sun's rays falling no the sun's rays um, they can take the help of sun's rays and then the uh, next uh, the coastline coastal line they can some birds recognize the coastal coastal lines and the sun's rays they can uh, remember and they can come back to the after completing their migration they can come back to their homes their nests so like that only have in that the birds and the animals migration so some scientists also they can uh, search how it's possible they can arrange some uh, uh, some uh, how they can travel where to where they, the birds are traveling they can uh, they know where they know in purpose they are searching some scientists how it's possible like that they are still searching scientists so like that migration having their birds and that uh, some animals also migrate like that only. Okay, children, completed now. See here in our textbook have the pictures. See these birds are migrating. See here, scientists use various old and new methods to study migration. So rings and tiny transmitters are fixed on animals to track their movement patterns. They have to fix the transmitters. They can hide that the, how they, they should look after the feathered friends. So and protect them from any harm. We don't create the harm. We can protect these animals and birds. Okay, children understand now. See here pictures also given now. Black swans, arctic terns. See here. You have to observe these pictures. Okay. See on land, on trees, in water, in air. So here organs of breathing, body surface, gills, at warm moist skin. Okay, grasshoppers, parakeets, whale, lungs, human beings, lungs, moist skin, in water, on land, lungs, frog, gills, tadpole. Okay. Next, uh, uh, beaks of some birds, okay, animals that the gnya or nibble, like pictures you have to observe clearly, herbivore animals, carnivore animals, birds of prey, okay, here four limbs, okay, four limbs, hind limbs, fins, here animals that swim, okay, these kangaroo, hopping animals, frogs, okay, locusts, here given see locusts. Okay, next butterfly, bed bug. Here pictures. Most birds use their wings to fly. Birds use their legs for many activities. Okay, next is some birds cannot fly. These ostrich, kiwi, emu, crocodiles, snakes. Okay, next year, walking, running, human beings, fingers. Here 
specially movement different different types of movement uh, here no this picture you are observing means it will clearly understand in water in air on land okay here fishes have fins paddy like limbs turtles okay webbed feet frog uh, wings and feathers birds wings and scales butterflies scales snakes short legs crocodile next deer okay long and strong legs okay migration among the animals like that uh, black swans arctic terns okay understand the lesson no okay once you have to read the lesson that is the homework